Hello everybody, we are back playing some Obscure. Um, as you can see, we are all free of the cages, so what I hadn't realized on the last episode that um, I couldn't actually access any of the inventory, which included all of our save discs, so off camera I had to um, get us all out of here. Um, so you haven't missed very much, but we did manage to escape with that bar. What I basically did was go in here and I used it to flip a switch over there, um, which let us all escape. So it was very convenient that the bar was um, in that cage over there. Um, so we essentially have Kenny back, which is pretty awesome. Um, he was with us in the beginning of the game and I thought he was dead. So what I'm going to do is recruit Ashley. I'm right behind you. Okay, so all of us are down in here. We've got a door over there. And we've got a door in the back here. Okay. So there's basically just one way to go. I think this is the way that we came in. I'm not 100% sure. Okay, so let's... Okay, I heard something. What are you? Okay, this is one of those big, big guys. So hopefully she can hit him with it. Come on, shoot him. Oh, ouch. Come on, man. Okay. Hopefully there aren't a huge amount of those guys down here. I don't have a lot more shotgun ammo. I'm gonna switch to the the pistol. Actually, that's the automatic pistol. Let's do that. I mean, it uses the same ammo. I'm not sure it matters. Might as well be automatic. Okay. Okay. Hopefully we're not about to get separated or something. I need a tool to bring the ladder down. We're gonna use that same tool that we used to escape to lower this. Okay. Is there anything over... nope. Just this ladder. I hope our friends are okay back there in, in the prison cells. Last. Did they follow us? We're... okay, where are we now? All right, we're back in the school area. There's a question mark right in front of us. It is so nice to be out of there. Man, it was a cool area, but it was very dark. All right, we found some type of door. It's a padlock. I need a big pair of cutters. A big pair of cutters. Do we have some? We do have some cutter- or we have some pliers. Okay. I forgot where we got those. Oh, here we go. So all of us are back together. Okay, so we're back where we started, essentially. I'm actually going to make a stop here at the janitor's closet. I want to see if I can play those tapes. I don't know if that's something that I was supposed to have done. Looks like it. Hey, it's the video surveillance archives. Somebody's leaving the gym. Somebody's following him. Isn't that Kenny? <laughs> Fast no. forward, this part's worthless. Stop! That guy, there. It's Friedman. Why is Kenny following him? And where's he going? Oh, a secret passageway. Kenny? He's not going to follow him down there. Fast forward! They're coming out. It's Friedman. 
He's locking the door behind him, the bastard. So this clearly was supposed to be seen prior to us saving Kenny. And who's that guy? What's he doing? I just don't get it. This is kind of nauseating, honestly. Now he's coming back out. Sure looks like he's in a hurry. Oh, the monsters! That's where they come from! He's the one who set them loose! Great. So, was there any other videos? No. Was it just that one? Okay. Alright. Oh yeah, that was the part I accidentally missed. So we've come to a door with some more um, padlocks on it. Alright. Was this where Kenny was? I think it was. Oh, here's another. Okay. Yeah, I remember this. So, are we supposed to go in this room? I don't think the nurse is in here. It's been abandoned ever since those people went missing. Oh this, this cannot be good. I have to be careful because I haven't saved. No. Maybe I should switch to the baseball bat. Newspaper cuttings referring to the disappearances. Uh, is there a window I can smash? Okay. Definitely need that. Looks like there's a bunch of, you know, cigarettes and candles and alcohol in here. We got some light in here. So... so... They aren't so, um, aren't so brave when there's some sunlight in here. Uh, okay, this, the camera shifted over to this. A chimney flew. Okay. Yeah, I'm not sure what I'm supposed to do with that chimney flu, at least not for now. Really wish I could see in front of me. I'm definitely hearing statuette. Okay, so that's- that looks like what's over at the fountain. Let's go into the bathrooms again. So I heard broken glass. Oh, so the- The two bathrooms have been, uh, combined into one. Okay. So... There's an energy drink. The sink. 
the door, okay. Shannon were here, she'd help me out. Yeah, so they're asking for Shannon again. But Shannon is a terrible fighter. And I think for me at least, it's been better to choose somebody who's a better fighter. That door is locked. That door is locked. So getting ambushed right at the front door is easily the way that I've gotten killed the most because I just have no space. <sighs> you just immediately get attacked and you're in this tiny little area. Okay, so there was just mainly a few items in there that we needed. But it didn't look like anything that furthered the story. Okay, I think we checked everywhere down here. I guess the only way forward is to go up. I really have a feeling that chimney flu has something to do with this. This should be no problem for me. Oh. oh. This? I'm sure I can pick this. This lock looks easy. Well, thankfully we checked all these lockers. Nothing? Okay, so I guess we got a energy drink. Alright. We're gonna head upstairs. I think we checked everything down there. We've got to find an antidote. I don't feel so good. So she keeps saying that she's feeling bad. I'm sure I can pick this. I don't know if that means she's going to turn into one of those things. I'm not sure if it's just her. Okay. Come on, come on, come on, reload. We know that Mr. Friedman intentionally let these all loose on us. He's just a first rate guy. He's hurt. <sighs> Alright, so it was in that room. Didn't seem worth the fight. Okay, we got a cutscene. Calm, Calm down. down. What doesn't seem that strong? Uh, the door seems to be locked. Nope. Oh, oh no! Ah, oh, what? Okay. 
so... <laughs> Wait, what? Calm down. Doesn't seem that strong. Okay, so I had to redo this area two times before I got back here. Um, so I did find two items that I hadn't found previously, which was a light grenade and some ammo for the shotgun, but otherwise everything was pretty much the same. It looks like the, fo the floor uh, falls beneath you, so you have to be careful and not fall through it. You can kind of see it and hear it. Okay, whoa, 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 whoa. Okay. Uh, I don't know if it's just kind of random. Or what, but... Okay. Oh, no, no, no. Looks like I need to go maybe on this side. Yeah. So it's kind of a minefield, but it looks like only I can step through the floor. So if, if the NPC steps through it, it's probably fine. Okay, so... This is... okay. Alright, so we managed to get through that area. I thought it was just like... Putting us Shannon onto a, a different level, but no, it's it's instant death. Okay, so I'm kind of regretting not bringing Shannon along, but whoa, oh, okay, that can't be good. Looks like somebody who has like a bullet hole through the back of their head. It hurts. Uh, are they gonna fight us? What's going on? Um, wow, that is scary, man. This lock looks easy. I guess that person is not aggressive. Oh my gosh. Nothing. Okay. Is he gonna talk to us? So we found some random person in here, and they... They're not aggressive, and they're not helpful, so... Alright, where did you go, Ashley? Okay, so there- oh my god. There's another guy. No. 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 They're not trying to fight me. So I guess these ones are just turning. And we are too. Because of what Mr. Freeman did to us. We're we're gonna turn into one of those. If we don't create the antidote. A disc, okay. So is this you know like where they're keeping them while they change? Another chimney flue. It's not doing anything. Okay, so I'm able to. Okay, I'm able to move this. Maybe I need to move it like that. Um, doesn't appear like it's doing anything. Uh, I know. Maybe I'm supposed to push it like this. Oh, there we go. Nice. Okay, so we just had to knock that thing over. Alright, so we knocked, knocked that over and we opened this area. Dear sirs, following the conference in Seattle where your publications and particularly your work entitled Eternal Life is Possible were the subject of much discussion the experts examined your research and it was generally accepted that the use of your knowledge cannot be controlled nor can the ecological, social, and ethical co consequences of your discoveries in the field of life be measured. We had to reach a decision on the maintenance or not of the research budgets. 
What safeguard can be imposed against the eugenic temptation foreseen by your hypothesis? Sacrificing the enrichment of breeding for the benefit of an artificial and very certainly contagious life cannot receive our support. In conclusion, no assistance will be allocated to you. Okay. So it looks like he's, you know, trying to get funding for his experiments or something like that. Various books. Uh, okay, we just picked up a save. Um, what am I doing? I'm just carrying this around. Alright, this has to mean something. So I just threw the, the safe down the chimney. I guess I have to go to the other chimney and... Oh my god. Uh, come on. Let's bounce. What are you doing, man? Oh my god, I was super unprepared for that. Dang it. What's going on? Stop. Stop. I don't know what he's doing. Take it. Okay, so previously the monster outside here killed us. So I had to work my way back here. I don't know what. Oh he kind of got us just backed up into a corner and I just couldn't. Don't mess with me. Couldn't get the guns to work right. I don't know if that dropping that safe maybe awoken something. So, for now, we'll just stick with the- oh, kidding me? Okay, so, previously it was the floor that took us down. Alright, as you can see, there's a lot- A lot of these breaks in the floor. Okay. We finally survived that. Oh, like here, something. At this point, I just got the big guns out. I'm just like. For those monsters, you kind of need the shotgun. It's just so much easier. Alright, so I'm gonna- I need to find that chimney flume. Uh, was it here or here? Cannot remember which room it was in. Okay. Yep, it was here. Oh! Oh my god, another one of those! Oh god! What? I wonder what the name of these- these- or here, I'm gonna use the grenade. There we go. Have that. Here. We got her. We got her. Come on. Cool. The coffer broke when it fell. Okay, so one of those, one of these women was waiting for us. All right, let's get him a first aid kit. Wow, I'm ready to rock. All right. So. A map of the basement. We have to go back to the basement. This must be the key to the office in the library. Okay. It's December 2nd, 1969. My name is Alan Gardner, and this is my diary. 26. 
I have now counted 26 cases of missing persons connected with the school. Strange that the police have never come up with anything about it. Our school was founded in 1902 by twin brothers Herbert and Leonard Friedman. Herbert is still our principal. That would mean he's at least 100 years old. Well, I just found their birth certificates. Judging by that How date, have they stayed so young for so long? I found this photo of a woman with Herbert, or Leonard. She looks a lot like Ms. Wixon. Photos According from the to late this marriage certificate, Ms. Wixon and Leonard got married in 1885. Leonard was last seen in 1921. He supposedly died in a plane crash, but they never found his body. Or even the plane. I found some articles about the Friedman brothers and their experiments. Said to be so original that they went beyond. In 1890, human they went on an expedition to Africa to find medicinal plants. They stayed for six months and brought back a large number of hitherto unknown varieties. One strange specimen, Mortophilia, became the basic subject of their research. Photos of disfigured people in his office. I absolutely must find his lab. Underneath the high school, in the basement, I managed to follow him unnoticed through the gardens to the basement of their house. I searched the lab, and according to Friedman's notes, the anti-aging serum is yet to be perfected. The photos of half-human creatures bear witness to the failed attempts. Prolonged exposure to the sun results in mutation. There's also a big door in one room. I don't know what's behind it, but I think I understand how to open it. There's a mechanism with little statues. I've seen three of them around the library and the one in the garden. Now I'll go and try to see what's going on behind that door. Okay, so we just learned a lot of information. Um, so yeah, nobody noticed that he never ages and he's supposed to be a hundred years old. I guess I need to go find all those statues. That's kind of what I had gotten out of it. Out of that. Is it this part of the library? Yeah, because we were in here before. I think there was a locked door behind here. Is this what they... Yep. So this was the, the door that we just got the key for. Okay. Here we are at last. Okay, there's a statue. Okay. Two more statues to go. A very powerful flashlight. The boost can be used for a good while. A key. I don't know what it opens. Ugh. I'm really afraid to watch those films now. After the other one that we watched. You're still here. I'm infected, and I need to find the antidote. An antidote? There's an antidote? Are you you're sure of that? There better be one. But we need to find the lab with a big door. But how do you plan on finding that lab? I found a map with a basement. A map? Hey. It's a... Uh, you're going... Uh, oh, jeez. Is he about to turn? Hey! Hey, he's getting away with my map! That bastard, he stole my map. Great, now we have to go recover the map. Is that the mysterious door? I don't know, but I really want him to give that back. We've just opened up... Oh, okay, this is the upper area. Just one more statue to find. Nice, we found that. Maybe I don't want to waste the ammo on that. Here's a padlock. Am I in a totally new space? Can't tell.
Okay, so he's hurt. Let's uh, get him a energy drink. All right. So there's so many classrooms up here in this library area. Let's get this door open. We got a grenade in there. That kind of doesn't bode well. Typically when you you have grenades, you're typically you're about to face something fairly difficult. I'm surprised that every single door we can open, typically it's locked, locked, locked. and make sure he doesn't grab us. Okay. My guy has so much in his inventory, it's hard to sift, sift through it. Okay, we got another. Right. Powerful revolver with six shots. So we searched all three of those classrooms. They all had some stuff in them. They all had some monsters in them. I think that chair's just kind of moving on its own. There's a lot of energy drinks in here. <laughs> Just makes me wonder, what are we about to face that requires so many energy drinks? But where is this door gonna lead us out to? Okay, so we're at the top of the library. Okay, so we escaped the library, so my goal right now is to head down to the amphitheater to play those uh, reels of tape. Alright, so I've made it here to the amphitheater. Um, I've got another reel to play, so I'm assuming I just need to go up here again. I wonder if I need to pull down that, um, that screen. Oh well. I guess we will find out. I can't even imagine what's gonna play on this. The other one we saw was was just awful. At least we don't have any creatures to fight. All right. I'm not sure how I'm supposed to know which is which. Real of film twenty four. Real of film twenty three. Guessing it's twenty four. Friedman. O five eight two. That has to mean something. What a weird movie. And what's that number supposed to be? Alright, so I guess that's the code to get into his lab. It's kind of funny that real is just a close-up shot of that code. Was that really what they intended? I'm sorry if you can hear thunder. It really is thundering outside my house. Oh, five, eight, two. All right, so we are in here. Okay, it looks like we ended up in the woods. Oh, this is just gonna be fantastic. I can already tell. So, what is this stuff here? Looks like it's gonna come alive and take me out. I'm guessing there's no- oh, there we go. Actually... Oops. Stop. Oh, come on, are you kidding me? I can't. Okay, so no surprise, I died. 
And this is the second time that we're attempting this area. As many times as I fight those... Those guys, I just... Don't seem to have an ability to uh, effectively kill them. So I'm gonna use my shotgun here. So they can just, you know... You really can't let them get anywhere near you. Once they get a hold of you, it's over. If there's anything this game seriously needs, it is a health bar. Maybe I'm just missing it, but it just doesn't seem to exist in any way, shape, or form. Where are we now? I think we're totally off the grid. Oh, jeez. Alright, so some, some difficult enemies out here. I feel like I didn't explore a bunch of that forest back there. But I'm really not sure what I need to do. It's cold out here. Cold out here. Yeah. Man, you just don't die. They have some serious health that I'm running low, relatively low on ammo. This wall seems pretty weak. Okay. Um The wall seems pretty weak. Okay. So I'm just gonna smash it with this. There we go. It works. Oh so, now where am I? Let's go ahead and reload. So most of this game has been inside, so it's kind of cool to be out here. Oh, is that the statue over there? Oh, I see something glowing. A lot of twisty paths going on. I really, really want... No, I need that, that statue. Well, there's a door there. Okay. Alright, so here's what I need. Okay. Alright, oh, of course, of course. Oh no! Okay, so... I switched to her. Yeah, they were waiting in ambush for when we picked that statue up. Okay. So I'm just really hoping I haven't missed anything significant, but that's what we really needed was that statue. Alright, so we're headed back to the place we were just at. Go through here. Oh. I kind of hate using, uh, bullets on those guys. And I really hope I find bullets soon. I might have to give her a, uh, baseball bat. Which is not ideal, but I only have four bullets left. Okay. What's that? Alright, and I honestly didn't really even need a first aid kit. What I needed was bullets, so... Please let this be bullets. It's the house from last night. What was that? Nope. Is that another first aid kit? Oh yeah, here- yeah, here's the place from the beginning of the- Oh jeez, of course. Oh, there's one behind us too. No, 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 die! Come on, Ashley, are you kidding me? 
Maybe we'll go off on another path since we died. This. Uh, ooh, there's something. Definitely, there's definitely something up there that we might be interested in getting. Do we get it? Uh, gosh, what is that? Oh, jeez, who knows? I can't get back on my feet. It's really low. Alright, let's get her first aid kit. Yes, this is an area that I hadn't been over. There we go. Alright. A pump action shotgun with two cartridges. All we had to do is smack that a little bit. Okay. So it only has two cartridges. I'm not sure why it's better than the other one, if it is at all. I gotta remember to use the grenade though when I'm dealing with some of these guys. Okay. So I'm not too upset that we died, given that I hadn't found that that weapon. Okay, so after redoing this area a few times, I finally managed to um, beat it. There was a couple of energy drinks up here. A lot of these doors are open. I'm assuming we're going down into the exact same place that we did in the beginning. So, yeah, this is this is exactly where we were when the game started. And I was kind of freaking out because I'm like, why... Are they giving us a gun? What kind of game is this? Something is missing from the mechanism. Alright, so it said something was missing from the mechanism. Don't know what that something is. Guess we just have to... What is try and thing? find it. Is that it? I have to assume so. Awesome. Okay, so we just found it just lying there on the ground. That was very conveniently placed. What is this? Nope, nothing. Some things light up and I think they're really important. Okay. So that wasn't there before. Those barrels weren't covering it, it before. Alright. It's definitely done. making this a save point. Took a pretty good amount of time to get through that area. So they're giving us quite a bit of ammo and um, healing items, so... Alrighty. Hope we're ready. Is there something already, already up there on the ceiling? Yeah, I remember at the beginning of the game, there was something... It wasn't even a monster, but it was kind of just teaching us how to use the light. Is there anything else? Don't mess with me. Convenient ammo... ...location. Alrighty, so we're going. We're going in here. Hope I'm ready. Kind of wishing I didn't use that light grenade. Oh well. Alright, this is so nostalgic. Kinda. Except for I got killed here. Which is supposed to happen, but it scared the crap out of me. I jumped so high. I was really not expecting, not expecting that. Oh. 
I'm ready for you now. I'm ready for you now. Oh crap, there's somebody behind us. Oh, this is great. No, turn around, turn around. Alright. The bad thing about this gun is that it reloads very slow. So one one in front and one behind us. That was a nasty trick. So the door was literally thrown. All right, it's that same cage again. Oh, I can't. Oh, I can. Thought I couldn't move the door that time. We found that kid down here before. I wonder if, um, uh, ooh, what is that? Something just shook. Okay, I guess I'll go in here. Is he still in here? Oh yeah, he is. Poor guy. That sucks. We had to kill our friend, who is still locked down here. I'm kind of afraid to open this door. If it's shaking the room, then... Cannot be good. Cannot be good at all. Okay. Another save disc. And an energy drink. Man, look at this place. This is just wild. Okay. Can't believe I survived. Here, Stop talking about Shannon. Nobody likes Shannon. Shannon dies after one hit. It's revolting, but what happened to this poor person? Was that that student that we saw? Maybe? Oh, here. Maybe I could move this. I love how Ashley's not helping us. Come on, Ashley. Okay. Kenny? I see an item there. Am I not able to pick it up? Okay. Maybe there's just a door there? Oh, there is a door there. Oh! Thought that was an item. Maybe it's not. Okay. We just need to go in here. I really hate those guys that hang from the ceiling. They're some of the worst. All right. A laser? What? They're giving us a laser gun? Oh man, what kind of stuff is, are we going to be doing now? God, do I even want to know? Holy crap. Yeah, so apparently we've just become amazingly armed with a laser gun. I can't quite understand how... That technology is harnessed in this place. So there's a ladder and then there's a door. So it's possible that's not the correct place to go. Let's try the stairs. The ladder. Okay. Whoa. Look at those things on the wall. This looks familiar. Okay, so instead of going forward, I actually went back and I found this door. Okay. What the oh. Hell? Oh. I hear a ringing in my ear. I guess it rings? That was pretty awesome. Alright, so we found this place. There's an energy drink. What is all this stuff? 
first aid kit. What is down here? Okay. Oop. God, that the noise that this gun makes is just excruciating. So it really doesn't look like my gun is cooling down. I wonder if it's just like a one-time use type of thing. What are these machines? It's not like they told us how to use a laser. Okay, so we gotta deal with... Woman monster. Number three. Actually, this is a really bad angle as well. You have to kind of get up close to her face. For any of this stuff to work. Just try switching to... That? Because I think she has to like open her eyes. Come on. Yeah, I'm not sure what the, stra the great strategy is for this, like... Okay, so we... We got her. Perfect 3 out of 3. I don't think she's ever killed us. Which is kind of miraculous. Alright, what is in this room? Man. Something is missing from the mechanism. Okay. Are these where the statues have to go? Alright, yep. This is a very intricate machine, I have to say. I feel really bad for a person who forgot the statue in the in the forest. That would suck. Oh wait, am I supposed to do something with the mechanism now? So we died in the cheapest way imaginable. Someone came at us from two sides. That's the only way this game can really kill you is if they trap you in a, a sandwich here. I'm gonna go trigger that and then come all the way back here. here. So we can fight this guy. Shoot him! Come on, Ashley! Okay, okay. No, you can turn around. Okay. Come on! Shoot him! And okay, we are gonna run out of ammo. Man, I hope they give us some. Yeah, this is kind of a, a game where you really have to learn from your deaths. We had three of those guys. Of course, now we find the, the grenade. Alright, so we got two diverging paths. Let's just try this one, I guess. So we're getting quite a few save discs. Thinking I should probably use them. I'm hearing those screams. We've been hearing them the whole game. I guess it's from the people who are locked up down here. What is this thing? Looks like a paper towel holder. Turtle, uh come in handy somewhere along the line. Okay, so we found... Alright. This must be where I use this. Yep. Alright. A very pixelated cutscene. Hey, is that the guy with our map? We could have really used that map. What are all these statues gonna do? Moving something. Okay. It opened something.
Is that where we where we were? I think that's that place that I didn't want to deal with. Kind of look like it. Was it up here? Looks like we just opened the gates of hell. So well, that should be fun. Stop. That won't help. You're lying. Shoot him. But it won't do Get you him. Good. That's the antidote. Give it to me right now. You've yeah. been exposed to too much light. No. Walton, stop. Give me the antidote or I'll shoot. You've already started to mutate. Ouch. What is this antidote? Uh oh. <laughs> Don't like the look of this. Oh no. Oh, the antidote. Didn't do him much good, did it? So here we all are, down here. So what the heck am I gonna do now? Bernard, forgive me. I almost found the formula. I almost did it. Oh, is that him? Is that the guy who died in a plane crash apparently in the 20s? Oh my god. Like some demented tree. I can, f I can see him rolling his eyes. Okay. Great. Man. I can't save. No. Let's shoot him. I wish I could just get her to. I'm not supposed to fight this guy. He's just. The, what I found out was the dark automatically kills you, so you need to stay in the light, like poltergeist style. Jeez, ah, he just keeps smacking me down. Come on, dude, seriously. Oh my god, he just whooped me, dude. Come on. God, he's. I think I'm genuinely on attempt number, like, 1,000. No. Ah, oh, Ashley! Come on, come on. So close. 
Oh, please, Ashley, please just shoot your gun. Oh, she was a useless fighter in this fight. Oh my gosh. Fought this guy 50 times. Or more. Oh, so happy to see his face crushed by those rocks. Wow. Controller was just shaking. I tried fighting him so many times. Oh, I hope that's the end. These kids had a very interesting night. They're gonna have a great story to tell. How did we just destroy the gem? Looks like it. Okay, yeah. And we've got the antidote. Is it enough for everybody? Man, looking at Kenny up close like that. Ah! Uh, are you serious? You cannot. What? <laughs> oh, you gotta be kidding me! Oh no! Are you freaking kidding me? Honestly, I don't even care if Kenny's dead. I'm not fighting him again. <laughs> we tried so hard to keep everybody alive to this playthrough, but... That, I mean, he got hit like one time and immediately dead, so... Oh well. That sucks. funny that the one character I thought was dead all along ended up actually dying. The only one who actually died in the, the whole game. Well, the sun is shining through the school now, it looks like. Now it's going to make me feel bad. That was my whole playthrough of Obscure. Um, had a pretty crummy ending, sorry, but just couldn't be helped. Um, but I hope you enjoyed that series, and I will see you in the next one.